at the last second when you think they're gonna go in, drift away, and that's a big yeah. deal. Yeah, yeah. That's not easy. All right, game one. Mm -hmm. Uh, Azul versus. By the way, a lot of A names. Aklo, Azul, Android Zero. True. Um, yeah. Okay. Azul Fox, and uh, I. You know, I've seen. I've seen a lot of him. Uh, Kind of at locals and stuff like that. I honestly haven't seen him play against a ton of outer region players, so I'm I'm very curious how he'll do here. I definitely think he has what it takes. Yeah, he's so good. Guard. He's yeah, he's very good. He's got all the chops. Oh, he could have killed him for that. Oh, he yeah, could have killed him for that. That might have been a, a role that he was trying to buffer. Uh, who knows? Could have been a lot of things. Yeah. <clears throat> I like the spam a lot of aerial style with Fox. Okay. It's very hard to DI that one. I mean, how could you tell that I was going to go to the you know, right? To the right, yeah. It's, it's just very difficult to tell where, where that knee was going to send. You're, I mean, you're probably dead at that point. When you're getting knee to 80, you're not really yeah. usually looking to survive. Now, the big brain play is to know that if you get... Oh, what did, what is he doing? Why did he drift in like that? But to, to finish my thought, the big brain play is to just actually DI for the one that, like, you could survive, right? Because if, if it did send to the left... You're gonna die anyway. I would say when you're, especially if you're playing against like a, like Mr. Cool Guy, like if you're playing against like Bobby Big Balls or something, that they love to go for those long extended combos. I always just combo DI, I DI away, because I'm like, look, if you want to do these cool flashy combos, I'm just gonna DI out of them. And yeah, again, like like you said, against Falcon, if you're getting needed 70, often man, you try to survive with the DI, it really doesn't matter. <laughs> you just get edge guard anyway. You're so far away. Yeah, so. for sure. Yeah. Okay. So far, this game Up has mash. been relatively even, except for the one sock that Android Zero threw away. Try to nair after the the down beat. You know one thing I haven't been seeing this uh, the top four that sort of disappointing me. Th this Android Zero has been down being, and people aren't just going out there and killing. Like that oh, was a really yeah. high down beat that could have just gotten destroyed. Could have just yeah intercepted it. Yeah, it, it, you should be able to, every time you see a Falcon down B or a Ganon, just on reaction get out there. You yeah. Know? That's, yeah, that's all you got to do. Agreed. You know, pretty much every good character can just on reaction destroy them for that. And you got to get that in your, your your toolbox. You can't let them get away with it. I agree. Yeah, I mean, that time, um, you know, I think Android Zero even, because like you said, he nared, right? So yeah. there was a world where he did, like, double jump air dodge, and he could have, like, eked back on stage. So it's like a little bit of a... Yeah, in theory, you can so, stay near the ledge and like, kind of cover so everything, much, but... There's so much lag after the down B. Like, he should have already been full hopping and back airing him before the nair even started. You know, right, like, right, right, right. Yeah, yeah you so, can kind of react to it. All right, Azul, pretty clean game one besides uh, Android Zero's weird. I mean, that was like basically a one stock swing, so it is a little unfortunate, but one or the other gets cleaned up. Oof. So Falcon, one of these characters, because of his weight, he's he's definitely harder than the other fastballers, Fox and Falco, for Fox to combo off up throws because you can't move as quickly after the up throw, right? So I always, I always feel like these days, like when I watch Fox Falcon, I feel like tech chasing as the Fox is, is quite important. Like, that's kind of how you get long damage strings at low percents, or like you you catch their techs with more grabs or up smashes. Right, and Falcon's techs aren't that good, so you should be able to, so that's nice. Exactly, exactly. See, look, he's gonna get it. Look at all the damage he's getting off of that. If you drop that tech chase, that, that whole combo gets cut short, and a lot of Foxes do, honestly. A lot of foxes do. Yeah, Azul's, Azul's playing super well right now. Now he bounced off the stage so he gets to recover. Mm, I like that. I like that a lot. He catches him. Bro, you ever think about how crazy it is that the two side platforms on the stage, they're not quite exactly the same altitude? Yo, One's like a little bit. You can't do that by accident. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is the thing that gets no, me. Might, like, imagine it was like OBS and, he, and, and like the developer who made the stage, they clicked on it by accident. They pressed like the up on their keyboard that one time. And shift it up a little bit, like one pixel, you know? You're right, it could be. They have, they were like making the model and they accidentally like, like pressed up. up. Never, no never noticed. It never noticed, yeah. <laughs> it, it it really freaks me out to think about. It, 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 uh... Yeah, I feel like it, you know, like the way like designers get about like fonts being perfectly spaced and stuff? Mm -hmm. It's kind of how I feel when I think about it. Oh, he could have he killed him. He definitely could have killed him. I don't he know actually, why he didn't go he out there. He actually could have killed him like three times by now, but it's fine. Because he got, got it here. Sometimes when you do that up around the side platform as Falcon, they do, um, they get like a crouch tech. Uh, or like, not a crouch tech, but yeah, you like, or ASD ID on tech, whatever, so it's kind of like an OMSA tech. So he might have been looking to react to that. He might have been expecting that. And he didn't expect him to just fly upwards. So one of the few things I've been liking about Android Zero right now, is it's one thing to be fast, but it's another thing to be fast and also like have crouch cancels in the middle of your movement. 
Yeah. And that's like the scariest fast player. Where it's like, they're moving fast, but they're also crouch canceling occasionally, so you're just like not sure if you can punish them for they're like dashing. A, they're like right? a very quickly moving fortress. Damn, he killed him. Yeah. He's dead. Uh, he should have oh, been dead. Should have been dead. Making me eat my words. He could have. Oh, he could have died right there too. That would have been. Dude, uh, yeah, Android Zero. I mean, it's crazy because. Oh, you just kill him, oh, man. man. See, it's just. It hurts. He, that's my one, and he's done that. That exact error. Like, I don't know what's gonna happen when he gets a stomp at 80, and that's not great. Like, I should know when you get a stomp at 80 as Falcon that they're gonna die. For sure. No matter, no matter who you are, you know? Ooh, oh, okay. That Nair saved him, okay. He's a big fan of that, that yeah, that Nair that returns to the stage. Oh, was he? Was Ro? Mm -hmm. oh. Ah, when he misses the reaction. Go high. Going high. Keep going, Keep going. you're on Dreamland. Yep. You can, I have a chance here. Yeah. Dream a dream, that... dream, dream. The only problem is how much damage it does. Because <laughs> look, he was at 60 before the edge guard sequence. And now he's at 130. Because he ate like seven back hairs. Good right. DI, but he's so far away. And see, I'm yeah, telling you, right just there. go out! Look, now he's alive! Okay. Man, he could drop the game now. Ah, he gets him before he gets the edge cancel out. That was good. Honestly, so the other thing that he did was like, okay, it's one thing that he didn't go out there for the Falcon kick. The other thing, though, is you got to realize, like, Falcons love, there's this zone below the ledge that they'll go when they try to recover from below after the Falcon kick. And a lot of the times you get a free shine spike if you just react. Um, and he definitely had a free shine spike, but he, like, was a little bit scared of maybe getting stage spiked or something. Um, oh, no. Oh, 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 God. He gives it to him. An, ad an honorable man. An honest man. Azul. And when I say an honest man, I mean an honest young boy. And also up 2 0. Also so, up 2 0. It makes it a yeah. little bit easier to stomach. You won't, maybe won't regret it that way. Yeah, it's true. He's got some games to play with. He's got some games to play with. Okay. Yeah, Android Zero? Not really not, reacting not that hard. His DI. Not hitting that hard, man. Well, what I think what he's doing is he gets the hit and he thinks he expects Azul to DI differently than he does. So right there, he thinks he's gonna land on the platform and he goes for an upper follow-up on the platform. Okay, still gets the first kill. But uh, but Azul DI'd in such a way that he didn't land on the platform at all. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Shy guy's in the mix. In the <laughs> mix. Wants none of that. Mm -hmm. Get him out of here. Get him out of here, okay? You know who used to love doing that? Silent Spectre, my boy Jeff. Oh, he yeah. always took care of the shy guy. Just never. Yeah, he took to... he took care of him for you. Sometimes you sometimes uh sometimes you gotta help him out when you're playing him. I like that when I used to play Jeff, I would take a break from the from the battle and I would help him clear out all the shy guys. I'm like, it looks like you're doing uh looks like you're doing something important. So uh, I'm gonna help you out. I'm gonna hit him too. Okay. Can you get this uh, edge guard? That looks like a really hard edge guard. I was like, I don't know. You know, actually, what would have been wild is I almost feel like he had extra time to upper him because he did a tournament winner by accident. He actually had extra time to upper him because of the Shy Guys because they extended the 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 hit lag of the um, the up B, the Firefox. And that would have been really funny if the Shy Guys actually helped Android Zero get the recovery, but he tournament winner by accident. Yeah, so despite kind of him, him, him uh, hitting them, you know, you, yeah. you never would think it. You would, yeah, you would think they would have been resentful to him. But, oh, no. Oh, that's, yeah, that's, that's done. Fox is for Smash, so cheap in this matchup. Oh, yeah, super good against Falcon, it's so, yeah. so cheap. It's just so good. It's weird. I, I don't know why I feel this way. I yeah. feel like it's... For some reason, I feel like it's better than Falco's in this matchup. Because it's not <laughs> strong. Of. It's not as strong, so even if they DI up, they don't go high up enough to Falcon King a lot of the time. You see what I'm saying? You know how, like, with Marth, a lot of the time you don't want to tip her fair, you want a weak fair? Because then they don't go high up enough to get a recovery mix-up? Yeah. Um, when you're just when they don't have a jump, it's kind of like that. Like I feel like a lot of time you forward smash at 60 and they don't go, they go, they fly in such a way that they don't get another mix up and it's just they just die. Uh, whereas Falco they go far enough that they might be able to di up high enough to Falcon kick or something. Okay. And off, by the way, to keep himself in it. Oh my gosh. And it was important because right now Android Zero just gave up a critical sock. Let's see if he can still clean it up. Oh my God, Randall's in the mix. Oh, that's so. Oh, this is getting dicey. Nice. To, oh, oh no. 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 Be careful. Think about your. Yeah. He thought about his options. I like that. I like. Take a little time. Yeah. Take a breather. Okay. He gets the third game. Damn. Yeah. Cause that that would have been a three zero if not for uh, if not for uh that. <laughs>
<laughs> that that little baby comeback he did. It's so important in those situations to when you when you have the ledge, think for five seconds. You don't have to like ledge refresh or you know do something that's gonna put you in danger, but just like think about don't just wave land in, you know, like and they, and get him yeah. with the back air or something. Like think think for five seconds. Sometimes people are yeah. Sometimes people will just kind of bait the obvious stuff and. Um, yeah, it's, uh, I know exactly what you mean. It's, I mean, it's like the ad is just like, you know, if they're, don't give them what they want, you know? Damn. That's yeah. an insanely good crazy. E, by the way. Yeah. He read the jump too, because I don't, if he, if he didn't jump there, the fox, pretty sure that would have been a reversal situation, no? Definitely. Yeah, you can shine stall there. Uh, I think with even stocks, it's worth going for, though. I don't think that's a, a terribly bad decision. I, I think it's, uh, it. yeah, it's, it's a gamble, but I think it's a, it's a favorable gamble. And I respect him for going for it. Hey, so I wanted to say this earlier. I haven't noticed Android Zero doing this a lot. A lot of uh, Azul's pressure so far on Shield. He does, does a hit on Shield, and then he either does a full hop or just a, just a generally um, high jump uh, mix up. He hasn't been up airing those. Um, I'm touch and go. It's kind of touch and go, yeah. And, and it's, that's like almost exclusively what Azul's been doing. So I'm surprised he hasn't picked up on it by now. But we'll see. Mm. Okay, and just knee it. I love, I love the knee there. And he gets ah, the edge guard. Reverse, perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay, Android Zero. I mean, he's up a full stock now. I, I feel like if he wins this game four, I actually feel like the with his momentum going into game five, I feel like he's the favorite for the set. I almost, I almost feel like this game might decide the set. We'll see. Right. So that's a, oh, you know, so it's crazy. he, he, he actually crossed his path, but he just didn't throw out an aerial. Um, Some of those edge guards can be so hard on Falcon. You, you, you gotta understand it's part of the game, you know? When they're that far in, you kind of have to go for a read. Yeah, I, I think it's... The problem with Falcon sometimes is I feel like players... They think them, they think to themselves, it's Captain Falcon. He has a bad recovery. I should be able to react to everything and cover everything. Um, and sometimes you just kind of want to make a read. Sometimes it's not quite so simple. Ooh, get up attack. Get up attack. I, that might have that might have mattered. I, it I, might I can't mattered. Know. It might have mattered. Yeah. The, that means the thing is the video. Yeah, I the poor thing with, with Marth. Mm -hmm. Yeah, with Marth it's insane. Ah, oh, I missed the reaction. Andrew Zero has not been texturing flawlessly. Uh, he's been going for a lot of reads. Oh, boy. oh he gets up a second. No. You know, if he just need, it would he would have killed him. Yeah. That's it. Absolutely. And now we have a, uh, who knows who's gonna win now? Yeah. Now we got a real slobber knocker on our hands. He's got the grab, so maybe not. Okay, there you me. Just... Thank you. Thank you. I know he thought about doing some sexy stuff. I'm glad he kept it simple. All right, game five. And if the theory is true, Android Zero has the advantage right now, despite it being Azul's counterpick. Dude, I feel like with his momentum, the, the like, I don't know, man. Android Zero, I feel like he's he 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 gets hot streaks for sure. He Would gets you go hot back streaks to Fountain? Sure. Would you go back to Fountain as the Fox right now? Um. Big question. Uh, I don't know how much. I don't know how much Azul wants to stage. Okay, Yoshi story. Yeah, he goes Yoshi's. Respectable. Did he already use FD? He did use FD in the in the in the set, right? Because I feel like FD is the other obvious counterpick against Captain Right, Bell. right. Dude, honestly, wow, momentum. Momentum, man. I honestly don't. I don't know. I actually don't even. Sometimes I don't like the stage against Falcon. Like yeah, the he thing kills at like sixty. So he kills at sixty, and he's got some unique strengths. He can he can very easily short hop knee the side platforms from below, and sometimes that matters. Um, oh, oh my god, god dude, dude he's you just know the dying. Thing is, fast players love Yoshi Story. Yeah, they just they do. love moving around on the stage. It's uh, uh, Android Zero, he's really good at using the walls. Like he'll use the walls to recover. Mm -hmm. I actually, dude, sometimes I take Falcon to fucking battlefield. Just Yo, he's to, crazy just to... for that uh, down B right there. Sorry for cussing on stream. Um, yeah, I... it, it, it's oh, cool, dude, tough. You're good. Oh, stop! Oh, stop! What the that was crazy. Oh, how did he do? What Thank you, Brandon. Dude, I. Oh my God, that just broke my brain. What is? Yeah, I thought maybe he like up B. That was actually like a a, a really good decision. It killed him. No chance dude. of getting his double jump back. But dude, this is how you know he's got Douglas J. Falcon in his blood. Mm -hmm. Because when he has momentum, he's unstoppable. Any That's good Falcon, it, man. Is, any good Falcon worth their salt. This is what how the game five turns around when you when you do uh, you're on the verge of a 3-0 comeback. You know. That's how you know this is a, we're watching a future great Falcon.